Hello, and today I'm going to be making a smooth velocity engine. And I made one like this before, but that one was made by me. I saw this similar one, but it's also but also it's very better and simpler. And you can use this for games like do like if you're dodging or like if you're making a shooter. So this is good for that, and I'll link the main project in the description, but he didn't have a YouTube store, that's where I'm making one. So we're going to take a green flag as click block, and two variables. So we're going to make x velocity, or xv, x vel, we're going to have y vel. Curl sprites also, so that's what you need. Then you can set X vel and Y vel to zero and go to zero zero. You can obviously change this to if you put in a different one. Then we're going to take a forever loop. And then we're going to take out two sets set X vel and Y vel. And we're going to take out a plus. And then I'm going to take out a times and put it in here. I'm going to take a x velocity, a vel, x vel. I'm going to take a minus symbol out, two keys, so key, right arrow. Minus key left arrow, so I'm going to take out the left arrow. And then I'm going to change this to 0 0.9. Put that in x -vel. Now, we're going to do in y -vel, we're going to duplicate this. But instead, I'm going to change this to y -vel, so you can delete that. And put that as y -vel. And change this to up arrow and this one down arrow. And then put that in Y vel. Then we're going to finally do go to and take two pluses. And go plus X position plus X vel. And y position plus y vel. And if you do that simple line of code, you can see you get this staggering effect that is really smooth. It's much smoother than my other one. And you also get this drag effect. That's what's cool about this. You can see the percentage go up or down because it's times 0 0.9 but eventually it's going to get to zero so if i just hold it for one second it's going to take a while for it to go back to zero but eventually come back you can also change this to wad keys if you want and you can also do and remix and put sound and make this into your own game see you in the next tutorial